Hey guys, I wanted to do a quick Facebook Live on what to do when you are feeling under the weather. We just got back from a wedding in Albuquerque and I'm just feeling a little off this morning. So here's what I do. I'm gonna show you what I do just all over with oils and other things to help support yourself when you're not feeling so good. So first and foremost, we start diffusing. We start diffusing our oils right away. So what I diffuse is, let's see if you guys can see that. Okay, On Guard and Melaleuca. And um, depending on how much you put in your diffuser, this diffuser actually holds quite a bit. So I did five drops of each and it's gonna run for like eight hours. Um, but you could do, you know, if you have a smaller diffuser, maybe three drops of each. So On Guard and Melaleuca, the first sign that you start feeling not good, diffuse that right away. It works really well. I made a roller bottle blend of all of these oils. So five drops of each of oregano, frankincense, Melissa, I'm sorry that the camera's going in and out, guys. Lemon, Arbor Vitae, Melaleuca, and On Guard. And these are going to be really, really helpful. So you put them in your roller bottle. You fill it up with, put your oils in first, fill with fractionated coconut oil. And then you're going to roll this onto the bottom of your feet, on your spine. And do that, you can reapply every 15 minutes. But having that going to support you and getting those oils in your system is really important. Lemon is a great oil to help support with sore throat. So you could do a drop or two of lemon in some warm water and drink that to just help in that area. It's also very alkalizing. I like the deep blue because turmeric or curcumin, those are really powerful anti-inflammatories. So you can take two deep blue polyphenols and that's going to help to support you. Some vitamin D3. So this is really important too. So this is liquid. Oh, hi, Susan. Thanks for joining us. Um, so whenever you're not feeling well, I up the vitamin D3. You know, as you guys saw, we oil up, right? We diffuse, we get our roller bottles going, and then we support ourselves with things. So I actually increase the um, vitamin D3. This is the one that I um, take here. I usually take about eight drops a day, and now I'm kind of probably going to go up to 10 or maybe a little more. Um, On Guard Soft gels, you got to start taking these immediately. I took one right away. Um, you know, taking them, and this is a good rule of thumb with all oils, less more frequently is better. So I took one of these this morning and I may take another one this afternoon or this evening. Magnesium is really important. You want to make sure that you're um, having lots of magnesium on hand to support you. So I up that. Vitamin C is so important when you start to feel like you're off a little bit. So you want to increase that as well. You can go for both of these, for magnesium and vitamin C, you can increase to bowel tolerance. So you can keep going up on those until you get loose stool, and then you're going to back off because you don't want loose stool to get dehydrated, but you can increase your magnesium and vitamin C as needed um, during times when you don't feel well, and that's just going to help support your body with that. I do like the X, X Clear, um, something to kind of rinse out the nasal passages. So you could use a, a neti pot, um, this is a really convenient one that I like to do, but just something to kind of get your sinuses rinsed out is really helpful. Eating lots and lots of garlic is really, really helpful to support your immune system and your body while you're healing. So doing lots of raw garlic, you can chop it up. You can just kick that back if you can tolerate it. You can put that in soups or on your food, but the more garlic that you can get into your system, the better. And then I have baking soda here and some Epsom salt. So these are really important because you can make a detox bath with these. So I like to do one cup of the baking soda and two cups of the Epsom salt here. And putting that in warm water, as warm as you can tolerate that, and you can use an oil with that too. So you could add in, Zendocrine is a really good oil to add in when you don't feel well. Zendocrine is the detoxification blend. So when you don't feel well, you can do a detox bath with one cup of baking soda two cups of Epsom salt and 10 drops of the Zendocrine oil would be great. Um, but it just depends on your needs. If you're having trouble and you're fixing to go to bed, you could do 10 drops of lavender or 10 drops of serenity. That would be really good. But this is, uh, again, my regimen for when you do not feel well. So we've got our lemon water going. We've got our roller bottle that has five drops each of the oregano, frankincense, melissa, lemon, Arbor Vitae, Melaleuca, and On Guard. This is like a huge immune support boost roller bottle, guys. And if you don't have all of these oils, use what you've got. Use whatever you've got. 
Um, by putting it and making a roller bottle blend and filling it with the fractionated coconut oil, it's just gonna help those oils go longer for you. We got our diffuser going with On Guard and Melaleuca. I like the deep blue because it's got the uh, turmeric in it, increase your vitamin D3, taking the On Guard soft gels, increase your magnesium, increase your vitamin C, having something to clear your nasal passages out, and that could be a sinus neti pot. You can even add frankincense to your neti pot. I like this X-Clear. Uh, doing more garlic is going to help support your system, and then a detox bath. So that's my regimen. Those are my tips and tricks for when you don't feel well. I hope that that was really helpful. That's what I'm doing today. You know, sometimes after traveling and being in hotels, you just need a little bit of immune support. And unless you guys have any questions, I'm going to bounce off here and keep working on supporting my system right now. So I hope this was helpful. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Thanks for joining. And you can always uh, catch the replay too. And uh, have a great, have a great Monday. Bye.